why is it a thrill to doubt the foundations of our lives? What you think you have and what it really is can be so different. Husband or my wife, my kid, that at least I have. You can choose to believe what you want to believe, which so many of us do. We kind of pull the rug from under that. The undoing, it's the story of a happy, privileged, successful family. I love you. Everything seems perfect. And then, of course, somewhere under all this, there's something very dark and very, very evil. It's about a marriage. And no matter how long you've been together, it can be completely destroyed within a matter of minutes. The show deals with an existential issue of are we really capable of truly profoundly knowing anyone else? David E. Kelly gave these wonderful scripts to me, which I read overnight and was, I mean, devoured would be the word. David's writing is like a striptease. It's just a little bit here, a little bit there, but it's so beautifully done that you can't help but go towards it. And then when we looked at directors, our first and only choice was Susanna Beer. Susanna is a brilliant, interesting, thoroughly original director. Her way of directing is unique because she's really empathetic. For a story like ours, her extremely cinematic film noir style is brilliant, especially here in New York. New York City is another character and has a really important impact on the way the story is told. That mix between social stature just makes it really explosive. The young people are vile. Ah! Oh. The undoing is about self-preservation and protection, and how wealth and privilege plays a part of that. We have a peek into this world of wealth that we can never access unless we naturally belong there. Status won't protect you. Charm won't protect you. Privilege won't protect you. You have always seen things so clearly. How can you not see this now? There is so much emotional conflict in this series. It grabs you and doesn't let go. It livens things up on the back of your neck. The story doesn't spare any character from being contradicted. You think you'll be rooting for one person and then your allegiances will switch. Everyone is culpable. Everyone is a suspect. Everyone's got secrets. This is what rich, entitled people do when threatened. They conceal the ugly truths to protect themselves. And they think they can get away with it because they're rich. 